Alright guys, going to put some uh, top off the transmission. So, pull this T-bar out, adjust your handlebars. Below here, you can fill the transmission. And we'll pull the plug either out of the side of the transmission housing. Or I'll get a screwdriver about the same depth to that plug and just check it. When you remove this T-handle, be careful because there's probably going to be a bunch of dirt and crap under here. So just be careful and mindful of that, not to knock it in the transmission. So, I got this gear a few years back when I first started researching on these truly built tillers. At the time my research indicated this GL4 to be yellow metal safe. And this should be best I can recall the book calls for SAE 140 or SAE 90 and colder temperatures but uh, we're gonna run the GL4 140 the only place that had this locally was O'Reilly's so I got this old pump gear oil pump probably hadn't used it in 30 years so we'll keep our fingers crossed that it works and try to fill it up. All right, I'll move the T-handle. I'm supporting the handlebars as I remove this. Grab that in the washer. And gently lift that off without binding our new cable. And as you can see, all the dirt on top of that adjustment. So I'm just going to knock it off. So I'll get an old brush and clean that up pretty good. Pull the drain plug out of the side. Seven sixteenths. Took a brush to it and cleaned around it. You see, the axle seals are leaking a little bit. I've got some new ones on order, but it's not too bad. Certainly take care of it. The wife needs the tiller right now, so. All right, well we got the gear oil, and I'll go ahead and start pumping it. The old pump's still working, so that's good.
see there. She was pretty dry, if not empty. See there, she's starting to run out. So, good to go, put the plug on it. Snug that up. Guys, gear all is full. Just show you in through the top hole. You can see the oil level shining, maybe. I don't know if the camera will pick it up or not. But you can see it in from the top hole. Okay, so we got the gear all topped off. We'll put the handlebars back on. Clean the threads off that real good. This tiller is in great shape. It's never been hurt. All right, cinch down. Now check the tines.